We begin tonight in St. Catharines, where marine units are continuing their search for a missing man who disappeared in the Sunset Beach area. As Jason Godola tells us, the man was on a boat with a group of people. Port Dalhousie Marina member Bob Niven says this pontoon boat seen here was the type of boat he encountered yesterday evening while investigators combed the Sunset Beach area searching for a man who vanished from a group he was with. Their, their exact words to me was, yeah, he could swim. Uh, he fell overboard. He was, it was wavy. He was trying to swim back, fighting for his life. We threw him a life jacket and then he just disappeared. Today, Marine units are heading back out into the water with scuba gear. Niagara police say they got the call about the missing man at around 6 p.m., adding he was with a group in their 20s who rented a boat. The people seen here talking to investigators say they're family and tell CHCH News they're looking for their cousin Steve, who is from Ottawa. Port Dalhousie Marina owner Nina Donatelli says there are very few rental companies along the Niagara region and limited options to launch large boats like pontoons. Even if it was someone local that had put it in a game and fish or sunset, someone would know, someone would have contacted me or, you know, we would have heard about it either way. Bob Niven tells me that there were roughly seven or eight people on the boat yesterday. Niagara police have yet to say how the man went into the water or if charges are pending connected to the incident. Boaters like Tracy Cookson say she and her family anchored out by Sunset Beach yesterday and went for a swim. They say water conditions weren't the best. The current was, you know, un unusually strong, I thought, because we drifted quite a ways away and swam back to the boat thinking, that's just odd. Niagara police are asking anyone who, are, uh, who happened to be boating out in the area or even possibly witnessed the incident to contact them.